So you are good at making Shopify themes, but you don't know how to sell them indirectly into Shopify. I'm going to show you how to do this process in a very easy way. The very first thing I wanted to do is to understand the Shopify templates. So what are the Shopify templates? If I go directly into Shopify.com and I generate my first account, you might be having access to your first store directly into Shopify. Now, if I focused into the left part that says the sale channel and I click for the online store, by default, you're going to be having an actual theme that you can use totally for free. If you wanted to have a different theme, you can go directly into the theme library and go here for this option. Let's go for popular visit the theme store and you have access to check out a lot of themes that we can use. Some are for free, some are for sale and you can generate your own and you can sell them directly if you have qualities uh, really great for selling well. So to get started, you must need a Shopify partner account. You must have a design software. For example, we can use the Figma. There's the AWXE. There's so much more. Even you can do it directly here from Shopify. So uh, and lastly, you might be having a Shopify theme kit or a liquid coding knowledge. So this is totally optional for advanced customization. But first of all, to start creating, you want to have a Shopify partner account, which is for free and gives you access to developer uh, toast. So to get started, first of all, what I need to do is to make some research from my niche. So we can check popular Shopify themes to see what's trending and identify the gasp in the market. So in here, inside the themes.shopify.com, this is the best way to look out for an actual niche. For example, here into the industry, focused for something in specific. For example, here have jewelry, we have the outdoor, rest and services, sport, and much more. Let's try it out, for example, with clothing. I close this, here's the catalog size. Let's go for something uh, less than 200 products. Here are the features and you can check out, for example, the Shopify flows exclusive, combined listings and quantity pricing. So we can see we have a lot of products that we can use. And if you kind of like one of them, just click in them and choose the option that says view the demo store. So you can try out the store and see how it actually looks. Check out all these elements that appears to the website. Um, check out how the animations that are done and if you think that's going to actually going to be worthy for you, what you can do is just to take the inspiration to generate your own um, templates. Now, the second thing is to design the template layout. We can use the design software to generate some mockups of the home page, the product pages, and the other key sections. We can make it clear, we can make it mobile uh, responsive and user friendly. How we can do this directly into Shopify? What well, we can do is to try out totally from scratch. For example, let's say I'm going to go for uh, a new theme let's go here for this this is done i'm going to customize this and inside the customization element what we can do is to generate for example here a new homed element we can check out here the theme settings we can check out on a specific logo um let's say for example that here i'm going to be adding a new fabicon which in this case let's say let's try it out with this one go for done and let's go for save every time you add something about your template for example let's go here for sections i'm gonna head back let's say that i have some rich text as well as i'm gonna click here have a slideshow let's go for add section once more collapsible content and as you can see it might be taking form automatically so with this information i'm gonna hit now into save and i have now my new template Let's go into exit and here into the sense I'm going to scroll a little bit down. This is the one that we've just done so far. Three dots and rename. Of course, this is not the best template that I have done so far, but I think this one will be uh, working a lot for this example. Let's name your template and create a demo store to showcase its features. We can write a detailed documentation to help buyers customize the template and to sell it directly like the Shopify theme store in battle or even your own website. So to sell your own products, there's two ways of how you can do this. First of all, you can try it out, for example, here into Etsy. There's the five up. There's a lot of places where you can just offer this kind of service. For example, let's say the Shopify theme. I click here, Shopify, and here are the results. So let's close this. Experience Shopify Expert, we Shopify Designs, level number two, Shopify Developer. 
developer, developer, CEO specialist, um, and much more. So basically here, we can just create your account, become a seller, and upload your own work like this to guys to dose, uh, do so. The other solution that I can do is to do it directly here in the social medias and give them a zip file. When they have a zip file, we can just download out my file, for example, here a tech te uh, template. I'm gonna go here for the three dots and we have to download the theme file. So I'm gonna send this to myself. So I have access to this specific theme and I can use it to further into the future. And here it is, I click on it and this is the file that's gonna be giving me. So now I can have access to this file and I can sell this file directly into Shopify. And when I sell this file, when I have this file, and when they make the part chase, what we can do is to go into add the theme, upload a zip file, add file, and choose the file that we have just downloaded for them. And there we go. Just as easy as to do it so. So something really important is to, uh, crucial of course, is to sell your templates uh, with marketing. So something that I can give you for a tip is first of all, is to create a social media account in your engaging post showcasing your template. We can write blog posts about the Shopify tips, include links to your templates, use email marketing to reach potential buyers in the platforms like the MailChimp or the Bravo can help you start with the setup automatic campaigns. And if you don't know what I'm actually talking about, if I say, for example, to go for Shopify themes in 2025, I'm going to be having a lot of blogs that I can um, choose, for example, the best Shopify themes and they can feature the best themes about it. So what we can do is to talk about a few themes and then you can just implement your own theme. So they will be willing, of course, to sell this directly uh, and purchase, of course, directly here into the actual app store. And really important, if you want your theme to be inside the Shopify theme, inside these Shopify theme store, you might want it to become a Shopify partner. So choose the option that says become a partner inside the account of Shopify.com. We can sign up with the same email that you're using to generate your website. And of course you might be inside the partner organization and submit a theme to Shopify. And there we go, just as easy as to become a Shopify partner. With that being said, guys, we have reached the break and video, so don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. If this was a really great solution for you, thank you once again for watching this video, guys. If you have any questions, you can leave it down below in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching the video, and hopefully we can all see you next time.